Hello everyone welcome back to Newtonian Nation we the physics students of Sri Ramakrishna College of Arts and Science are super happy to be back with another interesting video myself nihala and my friend batma priya are here to explain all about the pslv c52 launch now let's get into the video what is special about today's video ISRO's PSLV C-52 successfully launches Earth Observation Satellite 4, a student satellite InspireSat and a spacecraft dubbed InSat 2DT, marking it the first mission launch of the year 2022. Oh, is it? When and how was this launch held? The launch was conducted at 5.59 hours IST on Feb 14, 2022 from Satish Dhawan Space Center, Sri Harikota. This was the 80th launch vehicle mission from SDSC Shar, Sri Harikota, 54th flight of PSLV and 23rd flight of PSLV in Excel configuration. Well, could you explain about the PSLV C-52 launcher? Of course, let's get to know about it. The height of PSLV is 44 meter and it has four stages. PSLV and its title, the workhorse of this room through consistently delivering various satellites to low Earth orbits. PSLV C-52 carried two small satellites and EOS-04. Could you give a brief explanation about those satellites? And I am here to explain just that. Earth Observation Satellite 4 is realized at UR Rao Satellite Center, Bangalore. It is a radar imaging satellite designed to provide high quality images under all weather conditions for applications such as agriculture, forestry and plantations, soil moisture and hydrology, and flood mapping. Weighing about 1710 kg, it generates 2280 watts power and has a mission life of 10 years. Earth Observation Satellite 4 was launched into an intended sun-synchronous polar orbit of 529 km altitude at 617 hours IST. The vehicle also plays two small satellites, a student satellite InspireSat-1 weighing 8.1 kg from Indian Institute of Space Science and Technology in association with Laboratory of Atmospheric and Space Physics at University of Colorado, Boulder and Technology demonstrated satellite weighing 17.5 kg from ISRO which is precursor to India Bhutan Joint Satellite. Four passenger satellites were successfully separated from the PSLV in a predetermined sequence. Well, what was special about the launch? After 22 minutes of the launch, the fourth stage was passivated. This was done by removing excess propellants. The propellants used were mixed oxides of nitrogen and monomethyl hydrazine. Removing excess fuel is called passivation. Passivation lasted for about 10 minutes. Do you know about the future plans of ISRO? The first launch of 2022 has set in motion ISRO's plans to conduct 18 other missions this year, including high-profile launch of Chandrayaan-3 to the moon and the much awaited launch of the country's Ganganyaan mission. The 54th mission of India's workhorse PSLV saw the launcher climb up in the SSO. The space agency plans to conduct the PSLV C-53 mission in March, which will carry OceanSat-3 and INS-2B Anand into orbit. Hereby, we come to an end of this video. Hope you got some information about the first launch of 2022. Thanks for watching this video. Until next time, signing off.